This is breaking news. Loretta Lynn's granddaughter Emmy Russell stuns American Idol judges. That is a hit record. Third generation country performer Emmy Russell's run on American Idol is gaining steam. On Sunday evening, after being named in the current season's top 20, her performance of her original song, Want You, was favored by the program's judges, Luke Bryan, Katy Perry, and Lionel Richie. However, it also gained in social media popularity overnight. I want you to want me like I want you slash I want you to need me like I need you slash if you're gonna leave me, then cut me loose, she sang. Start the day smarter. Get all the news you need in your inbox each morning. After hearing the emotive ballad, Idol host Ryan Seacrest was emotionally overwhelmed. Upon asking if he needed a hug, Brian ran on stage and lifted Seacrest into a bear hug. Brian joked that Seacrest was the most expensive thing he ever held. Loretta Lynn's granddaughter following a legacy. As the granddaughter of the late country music hall of Fainra Loretta Lynn and great niece of 22-time global country chart topper Crystal Gale, the first decade of Russell's national career has intermittently included the release of singles and in 2023, a debut at the Grand Ole Opry. Another appearance on the Opry stage, along with Willie Nelson's son, Lucas, at her grandmother's CMT broadcast memorial, earned her a Performance of the Year nomination at the 2023 CMT Music Awards. For Russell, her journey on Idol is a personal one. At age 25, she is ready to define her own path in country music's mainstream industry. I'm not trying to please anyone other than myself, but if people find themselves and their journeys in my songs, that will allow me to make this my work for the rest of my life. Katy Perry is leaving American Idol amid very exciting year. That was so you, Brian told Russell. I loved it because it was so real, and I think you could really feel the emotion in that. That is what your artistry is about, and don't lose that. But listen, that thing that you did with that song really is your signature. It was very emotional and probably my favorite performance you've done. First of all, before we go any further, that is a hit record. Richie said to Russell after her performance, I don't care. We can talk about the future, but that is a hit record. And my dear, you are an incredible songwriter. Incredible performance. Orville Peck praises Willie Nelson's allyship after releasing Toot to Gay Cowboy Anthem. Miss Emmy, that was one of my favorite original songs you've sang, Perry added. I know that you were just a little nervous. I just want more breath, more long notes. Girl, like go swimming, learn how to hold your breath more. We need longer notes from Emmy, and I know that you have them, she continued. We need power. Come on, let's go. The time is now. In a recent Tennessean feature, Brian, currently in his seventh season as an idol judge, said that as long as it felt fresh, fun and reinventing itself, plus developing artists who can break into music successfully, then I won't feel like I'm spinning my wheels by remaining on American Idol. This season sees the country singer celebrating his frequent tour opener and 2021 Idol winner Chase Beckham's three-year-old single 23, which debuted on Idol, finally topping country's radio charts. According to Judge Ritchie, Brian won't be straying far from his Idol chair anytime soon.